Yeah. My daughter is ringing the breakfast bell for us to come down. So, we're getting ready to have breakfast. Oh, yes. I'm so very Hashtag this tomorrow. Y'all done? You know, man, this is how long it takes to take pictures of people so we Warning, protection by, that's a pistol. We don't call 911. Okay? Spirit, yes. Just getting some footage of outdoors this morning. Nice and beautiful out here. It's only about 60 something degrees. Wish I could zoom in because I can actually see the town from here. And it's a couple of cabins on top of the hill. This cabin goes way up. Hmm? Hello guys. So I'm excited about tonight. Um I'm excited about I've been excited about this whole trip because I have literally had to do nothing but rest. I did what I wanted to do, which is um just what I want to do. That's it. Um, we're going to have some panini sandwiches tonight. So we bought the panini grill from home. Um, we did waffles with the waffle maker this morning that we bought from home as well. And we're going to have um, panini night with salad. And tomorrow night is going to be our seafood. Um, what is the crab? What is it? Uh, uh, a crawfish boil is what we have in. Um, Kelsey and Ava are the chefs again tonight with this panini grill. Kelsey's great at making panini sandwiches. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I'm losing my voice. But I've been on a hunt. I lost my earring and I hate losing the earring, especially this earring because this is my cake spade earring. And I have the necklace on to match. And for some reason, it's the only set that I brought. And I can't find the other one. So. I've been on like the hunt looking for it, trying to figure out what happened to it. Did it go in the chair? And I haven't found it yet, so I'm a little sad because I want to find my earring. Um, I want to find my earring. I'm really sad about my earring. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to continue to look for it. So we're about to get started and shortly and uh, we'll get back with you guys and show you what we're going to be doing for the rest of the night. See you guys later. Okay, so this is lunch. Um, this was made by Ava and Kelsey. They did the lunch. Um, well, Ava. Ava did lunch. With this putting her hands in the um, camera while I'm filming eating the grapes. But Ava did the um, lunch. These are our panini sandwiches. And they're made with black forest ham, um, spring mix, and Swiss cheese along with pepper jack. What they what they made of? Secret sandwiches. Oh, wow. oh well, that's a secret sauce. sandwich that I just told a secret to. <laughs> and um, we got watermelon, grapes, and um, strawberries for fruit and sandwiches. We're getting ready to eat. My daughter is flying her drone. Getting the back of the house, so the back of the cabin. This is really a huge cabin. It's a million dollar cabin, so we'll get the, the full effect of how big it is from the back. 
That's her drone. They're on the second story. I'm on the third. Filming them. Doing yoga. It was great. You did That's my grandson and Kelsey is in the hot tub. One thing about my girls, they're not afraid of anything because I kept fussing at them about a bear coming up the side of the sidewalk and they tell me mama he has like three he has like three um three levels he has to come up to get us and we'll be in the house by that time so they're they're in the hot tub oh my goodness if y'all can hear all the sounds that are going on outside here I, I hear crickets and I don't know what else. But they're like making like a band out here. Oh my goodness. There's the zoom in. See if I can show you guys the cabins that are over there. I'm zooming all the way in because they're far, far away. But right where you see those white lights, those are cabins. They're like really, really far away. We can't see them unless I zoom in on them. And this sound is, oh my goodness. But they're outside in a jacuzzi at night, not afraid, not afraid of nothing. I'm about to have a fit. And they're just, they're just out here having fun. Don't be scared, Mom. We got Jesus. We got Jesus with us. Lord, she prayed for us. There you go. Now you can hear the crickets. Listen. Oh my God. Oh my God. That's why I went to sleep too. Oh, look at the moon, guys. Where? It's a full moon, too, so it's going to go up. Oh, it's a full moon. It's going to reach its apex, and then it's going to go back that way. Zoom in, it's a full moon. It's a full moon. It's in the trees. It's in the trees. We're getting ready to go inside and roast some, um, do some s'mores, and then we're going to bed. So, you want to know why we had a fireplace on in the summertime? We don't have a fire pit outside. So we're getting ready to roast some, um, not roast, what are we getting ready to do? Make s'mores. Yeah, we're going to make, s'mores, yeah. Yeah, gonna make some roast marshmallows and make some s'mores, but we don't have a fire pit outside. So we're going to use the, the fireplace inside because there's um, no need to have a fireplace on in the summertime in here. So that's what we're about to do. We're about to roast some marshmallows and make some s'mores. Got the s'mores ready. Marsh, roast the marshmallows and make some s'mores for the fireplace. We don't have a fire pit, so we have to use the fireplace. I'm totally fine with doing it inside. And we're totally fine with doing it inside. So this is day four. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, day three. I'm ahead of myself. Day three. I'm getting up to go downstairs to... um. I'm going really slow because um, uh, apodectomy is really makes you really sore. Your stomach's really sore. You don't get sick. Well, I did not get sick after surgery at all. Um, never vomit, never nauseated. Just a little sore. And um, it's kind of hard going up and down stairs. But you need to because it's good for you. It gets the blood circulating and you're not as sore. Just when you wake up in the morning, you have to get it, get it together. I'm going out here to watch my grandbaby while my daughter cook because where'd she go? Oh, she's all over the place. As you can see, she's tried to rearrange this cabin 30 times over. 
Um, she's afraid of the bears and the moose, so she won't go anywhere near that stuff. But anything else is like free game for her. But that's what she's been doing, just trying to terrorize everything in here. I think she's in there with Kelsey now. So I'm going to sit right here while my daughter do breakfast because I haven't been doing a whole lot. Just stepping out when I can. Sometimes they don't make me sit down, which I told them I'm not going to fall apart. So I'm going to place to charge my phone. We can do grits, I'll cook them. Oh my goodness, if I can get out this door. I'm always getting locked in doors and can't get out. Can't never get out. I'm stepping out here, but I should have probably looked before I came out. Yes. It's been really nice. Um, last night we just, I just got up and turned off all the lights in the cabin and we just slept in the pitch dark I mean there was nothing you couldn't see anything so I just turned off all the lights I just felt like turning off all the lights and I turned them all off and we just slept in the dark um, and it was pretty fun it was fun we had a good sleep um, this nice safe neighborhood we didn't hear anything um, they were out in the jacuzzi last night. I mean, not jacuzzi, in the hot tub. And, uh, well, jacuzzi. And it was, um, they had fun. Then we um, roasted marshmallows and we did some um, s'mores. So we had a good time last night. Tonight it's going to be seafood and, um, we're going to do some steak and mashed potatoes and a salad for seafood night. I think they're calling it, uh, what are those things called? Only my daughters eat them. But they eat stuff like, they eat crab legs, they eat squid, they eat octopus, they eat frog legs. They eat all kinds of seafood. Um, Kelsey loves quail eggs, sushi, but I don't eat any of that stuff. I don't eat seafood, I don't eat fish. So we're going to do steak and potatoes and the salad for me. So that's what we're doing tonight. We're also going to go visit the Mercer um, where it has a wine tasting. It's an apple um, orchard and we, um, we're um we going to do go see that today supposedly if it don't rain. We're trying to see if it rains. We may not go. But um if not, then we'll still go. So we're getting ready to cook breakfast and I'll get back with you guys later. Bye. I think it's about to storm. So we're getting a couple clouds here. Make it up. I'm actually sitting down trying to record. off a little too so that's probably a sign of a storm coming This is some crazy rain right now. Can't see the mountains anymore. It's raining so hard. It's storming. It's like a waterfall. I want to step out there and slip and fall, but it's coming down. It's a good time to go get in the bed. And that's what I'm about to do.
from that to side. We've been sleeping with these blinds open every single night. We have had just a glass cabin. There has not been, we have not closed the blinds that one time because we don't know how. They're electric. And we went to look for the, um, we can't find a remote for the blinds. So we just were sleeping with wide open blinds the whole time we've been here. And it's been amazing. It's been amazing. Shannon, this is for you. You always know that I have snacks inside bed. I know you're going to laugh, but this is what I do before I go to bed at night. So, we were actually playing uh, I Declare War with Caleb because he was bored. So, because he was bored, we had to find something to keep him busy. So, we're all going to play I Declare War. We got to get Kelsey up here. But that's what we're doing right now. You got to get big, girl. So, tonight is their seafood night. This is what they're having. I'm put the water in. Okay, so here's the face that I'm getting ready to season. And those are the crawfish. You know, they look like little roaches to me, but I mean, if that's what you like to eat. <laughs> and then we have mussels. They're still in the sink and getting ready to get those. Let me go get my computer. Get ready to fry those. Yeah, I'll wash her with you. What is it? Afterwards, after it's been cooking, cooking, but I think when you cook it all together, it all tastes like the same thing. So I'm not going to do that. I'm letting Ava ask me to narrate while I'm doing this because yeah. she's cooking along with me. So oh. I'm actually trying oh. to think. And she did the finishing of the. I don't eat seafood, but they're talking about how good it is. Oh, well, I guess it is. And she still has to put the muscles on. So we're going to use, here's the steak. Steak is cooking now. Ava, come get your, um, your stuff is starting to, I'm going to go over here and start this for her right quick. So she walked away and they're getting a little, um, Get my little uh, I think you may have should have cleaned your pan out and then put these back in there. Well, that's doing that, and the corn is going. This is a steak. I'm gonna use um, that's a crawfish. I'm gonna use this sticky finger. Barbecue sauce. We have two kinds, yellow and brown or red. So I just let those cook a little more. Put some water in it just to let it let it um, get a little little tenderized. In there. This is the beginning of the cooking for the seafood. I mean, I'm sorry, it's not a seafood. It's a crab ball. Crawfish ball. I'm sorry. Still ain't wrong. And that's the, she's getting ready to do the sausage. And we still have to do the salad and the mashed potatoes. The steak is being done by your Oh, wow, yeah. Mm. Amazing. So, I'm doing the steak. The crawfish is coming along. Corn, crawfish. Crawfish are all ready to go. Inside the mussels. I'll season all they need to be just steamed. She can pull up to the top. Like the overflow parking lot I took? Yeah, it's the overflow. 
That's why she can go out there and park her phone and think you can get up there. Uh, yeah, we can go out there. Yes, we have. We'll uh, y'all been bathing? Uh-huh. Okay, let's start. Tell Maya to pull up. Go up. Yeah, she's going. That's my clip. Tell her.